Hi there. So in this session, we are going to uh, see how this animation is work. So uh, in which you can see that there is a man, uh, there is a person who is climbing the ladder to go to the door of the what is the success or whatever. In each step, we can fill uh, here the steps one, step two, step three, and step four. And it is the animation slide, uh, which uh, definitely uh, your audience will like it. So, how we proceed? Uh, step one is we have to make a ladder first. So, uh, open a blank slide and uh, go to the set and select a rectangle and draw it here. Okay, now select select the shape, go to the format tab, uh, shape effect you have to go to the and uh, go to the preface and which you like. I think I am going with, yeah, presets too, I am selecting this, you can select what you want. Okay. Let's change the fill the color and fill in this with some yeah dark blue. Okay, now have, now you have to elect uh, again uh, select a rectangle, a small size rectangle. Okay, here yeah. Now we are going to bring our image or the person control c for copy and here is control v for the pass okay uh, select this rectangle and uh, go to the format there go to the set effect and go to the preset and select the same preset preset number two okay and also i am filling the same color on this Now bring uh, image. Okay, so just adjust. I'm adjusting this image. Yeah, I think it's look good. Okay, just look good. Now also look good. Now what you have to do is uh, just select this small rectangle. Okay, press Control D. Now uh, you have to uh, just uh, select this rectangle or adjust the height. Yeah. You look, uh, there is a, a, a red arrow. It's showing the, uh, I am on correct height between these two, uh, two steps. So that's all. And uh, now I'm going to just get a little forward it. Now you have to control uh, D for the same step. <clears throat> so I am pressing control D. Yeah, now you have to press Ctrl D for repeating the same step. Yeah. So I think one more. Yeah, okay. So uh, as uh, so we made our, our ladder 
and uh, step second is uh, we have to add animation to the our person so select the uh, person and uh, go to the animation and uh, you can see there is uh, many uh, animation there is drop down menu you can uh, drop down it and scroll down and here is a uh, motion part and you have to select the line effect so i am selecting this line effect and here you can uh, go to the effect option and select up yeah now you have to just select this and yeah now it's selecting and you have to go to the just bring this uh, person to the second place yeah okay here So he's, uh, uh, he's going to take one step forward. Now I am going to uh, select this person again and go to the add animation and bring the same effect line and effect option and up. Follow the same step. Okay, now I'm selecting this. and just start from after the previous so here you can see that the first animation is uh, and and here is the red arrow and second animation with green dot starts so we have to put in like this way now i am selecting this uh, red dot and bring this person to the uh, one one step forward which is this So it looks good. Now again, I am selecting this and go to the add animation and uh, go to the lines. Okay, effect option up. Now I am selecting this and bring uh, this to the after second. I'm selecting this person to the next step. Yeah. Once again, I'm selecting this and go to the add animation, select line, effect up, <clears throat> and uh, I'm selecting this now. bring it to the hair after this yeah. now I am selecting red dot okay <clears throat> so this is how uh, we set the animation oh okay uh, we don't need this name this is step so I can I am going to delete this and now I am selecting this step and uh, just uh, make it little more yeah okay now our third step is make a door so go to the here go to the home tab and uh, bring a rectangle select this go to the select the rectangle go to the format tab and here it's safe effect i am going to go to the shadow or uh, 
I'm selecting is okay, go to the glow option and uh, selecting this one. Select this uh, and uh, go to the outline. No outline. Okay. okay. Oh, little more glow. So go to the format tab, save effect, glow, and here. Yeah, it's look good. Now I am selecting one more rectangle in this here and this. something like this. Select this rectangle, go to the format tab, save. 3D rotation and uh, there is last option 3D rotation option you have to go to this. there is one uh, panel open we have to scroll down and go to the 3D rotation uh, select preset and in which uh, we are selecting this off axis to right okay mm, now I am adjusting this little bit Yeah. Oh. Okay. I want. Okay. So now this select this again and go to the set effect and glow and I am blowing this with this. Okay, select this outline, no outline. Okay, now select the previous step and uh, fill with which color you want. Like I am filling with white. Okay, so maybe I can adjust little with this. Okay. Options and this one, this one I am selecting, and now yeah. Okay, select both and press Ctrl G for grouping them. Now bring little bit here. Okay, select this uh, step and make it little bit shorter. Yeah. And now uh, you can add text here. Like I'm adding text one. I'm just copy the text. Let me add text. Okay. Step one. Control C, and now I am copying this. Control. So you can adjust this, this, yeah. okay. step two, and this is step three, and this is step four. You can write something on this. Okay, let me write. Fill the text. Okay. 
selecting the century format control c control a control v control a control v control a control v just copy and paste nothing else don't fancy third option and now four go so this is our all step or you can uh, place it accordingly yeah look okay now uh, we have to go to the animation and here is the animation pane you have to open this now select this text and uh, i'm selecting this animation for this step and effect from left okay and this bring it to after first effect Okay, select second, wipe, and uh, from left, we'll bring it after this, just after next, and select third, wipe effect, and from left side, okay, bring after this, and now the final text cover. So I'm selecting this wipe. from left and okay fine we can uh, see a preview by selecting the first animation effect and now play so i'm using the first step first text second step second text third step third text and here you can see so it's look uh, i think it's look good so we can uh, here format a background go to the solid fill okay and yeah i'm happy with this okay selecting the text Changing the color of the control A. Go to the home tab and white. Yeah. So okay, let me slide so this. I see what it look like. It's going to the first step. Okay. so uh, select this image and uh, bring uh, right click and bring to front okay and select this uh, do and bring uh, okay stand to back now preview so first step first text second step second text third step third text and the fourth step and so wow so this is how we can made a uh, ladder and uh, we can use in our presentation and we can show the how uh, we have to tag the step i am also going to uh, share this template so uh, you don't uh, have to worry about this Thank you